All right, welcome back, everybody. So last time when we left off, we got our house done. Just figured out where we want to go. So I think in this episode, what we're gonna do is I'm gonna get a little farm going. So we got some food. Uh, definitely get some fish. And then probably gonna start on the mine because I want to find some lava and pretty much rush to the nether. Definitely need that nether rack. So I think we're just going to start clearing land over here and we're going to try to flatten this out a bit. Get us a shovel. And get to work. Hot chicken. Alright, then just to save you guys the trouble, I'm just going to... I just cleared that land out real quick. And we're going to... We're not going to make it too big, because we're going to keep our house about the same size. I'm just going to pretty much do two rows of ten, plant what we got, get the beets, these are beets, right? Beet, yep, get the beets down, get the potatoes, avoid the creeper. Definitely going to need a bucket, we're going to need some water. Uh, got just enough. I pretty much got an infinite water source down here, so I'm not really too worried about making an infinite water source. There we go. That should be plenty. Still wish we had some carrots. Kind of disappointed we don't have any. But it's okay. Get rid of what we don't need. So I'm going to show you guys this awesome fishing trick. As I clear some dirt we don't need around here. Some of you guys might know this. Some of you might not. So you could totally fish in the house, in the safety. Check it out the door, shut the door, and just wait for the fish to come. I like these doors because you can see when the fish is coming up since they added the new update 1.10. Basically when you get a fish on the line, open the door, reel it in, cast it back out, shut the door perfectly safe. You can fish all night long. Now you can do it with a window too, but I almost prefer the door because sometimes when you do the window, when you bring the fish in, it doesn't really come back in. And that, that is kind of useless. Whatever. Tripwire. And there's a slime block over there. I almost want to go get it. Uh, it's Really want some slime. Make some sticky pistons. And we'll get we'll, we'll try to get one two fish and then I'll go get it. I don't think it's going anywhere anytime soon. I'm basically hoping for some good stuff off the, the fishing. I'm hoping for some leather, uh, books, paper, a better fishing rod. I really want a fishing rod with mending. Or puffer fish. If we, get a, if we get one with mending, basically it'll never break. I'll never have to worry about it again. We can actually, because you can level up really fast with, with fishing. It's going to be probably my number one source of experience for this game mode. Hoping I can still find some obsidian to make an enchanting table. So it's about uh, 2 in the morning. I'm going to fish until morning, and I'll see you guys when the sun comes back up. Alright, it's morning now. I know that because the skeletons are frying. So I didn't get too much. Uh, six fish, puffer fish, trip wire. Throw those over there. And we need coal. So, new plan. We need coal. I think we're going to 
go ahead and start the mine a little sooner than I wanted. Uh, to grab some wood. And I don't want to build it too far. But I want some room because I'm eventually going to expand. Hmm. You know what? This looks good. We'll just build it here. I'm just going to make a nice easy shack. Nothing fancy. Let's get a table. Probably going to have to go get a little bit more wood. Definitely need more wood. Yeah, let's go get some more wood real quick. So I know they always tell you don't dig down. It's like number one rule of Minecraft. Don't ever dig straight down because you'll fall into a pit. But I still do it anyway. I'm brave. I have little tricks. I usually dig uh, two by two straight down. Just because, you know, you can build the windy stairs down. You could build on an angle. But it's just basically a waste of time to do either one of those when you can just dig a uh, Basically, a two by one, you just go straight down. Ooh, apple. Apples are nice. Definitely gonna save all of those. I'll come back for the saplings in a minute. We're going to save all the saplings too. I have a challenge that I want to try to do. I want to try to plant an entire forest in a plains. Or probably the plains. I'm going to try to start off with a hundred of every single type of tree. This is basically my standard little build that I do for these. Get some sticks. We're gonna need lots and lots of ladder. And we're gonna need a couple doors. That there. That's gonna be dark in here. But we'll get over it. This is basically going to be it. Put the ladder on this side. And we're basically just going to dig down. Add the ladder. I do this because then I know... Ooh, iron. Then I know if I dig down here and it looks safe, then it's probably safe to dig over here. Like right now I know that there's... A little cavern down here. Which is actually kind of cool. It's nice to know this is here. Where did it come out at? Huh. It's actually not that far. Alright, well this actually gives, this kind of nice. It gives us an alternate entrance down here. Also be good if we need to Hoof it out really fast for monsters or whatnot. Grab this coal. I'm sorry. Sorry about the pause there. I heard something very strange outside. It was just a cat. Might have been a bobcat. No, no. Not worried about it. There's a lot of 
iron. All right, got a whole bunch of iron now. Got some coal. Pretty much good. Ladders. I think we're gonna run this over and we're gonna start smelting this iron. Definitely gonna need this. I wanna get the iron gear right away. And 25, that's pretty good. We'll drop these things off. I don't need them. Oh, chicken. So many animals. Well, that was a weird glitchy there. So I'm going to dig down here real quick, probably see you guys when I get back up. Don't want to, don't want to waste too much of your guys' time with the nonsense. It's just repetitive stuff. You guys don't want to see that. So I'll be back in a few minutes. Alright, and we're back. So I hit all the way down to level 10. About a level 10. 20 I start hearing water and I start hearing lava right now and I turned up the brightness a little bit I figured you guys might have a problem seeing because I know it's pretty dark I don't have any torches it doesn't bother me but I know how YouTube is sometimes it's kind of grainy so we're gonna just clear five by five in the general directions over here see what we can find nothing Oh, there we go. There's the water. Don't really want to stop it, so we'll just quarantine it. And that's what I was looking for. The lava pocket. And the skeleton. We don't want you. Oh, this is actually pretty nice. We got gold. Got redstone lots of lava thinking I'm probably gonna build a little bridge I'll probably stick the nether portal over there in that little pocket but we need to go get our iron first and I didn't even bring my bucket why didn't I bring the bucket I brought some lava up They're basically going to build the nether portal just out of lava and water, so I'm going to have to build another bucket. Oh, it's nighttime, isn't it? We need that gold. I need a clock. Yep, definitely nighttime. it over here real quick. They don't want to mess with the zombies. Oh wow, they're already growing. Alright. Plenty of iron. Gonna make another bucket. I gotta make some shears too, just because I know I'm gonna want them later. Uh, I don't have any flint. Except a bucket. I guess I'm gonna make some armor. Should be able to get most of it. Yeah. Just short. But now we have enough. There we go. Nope. Don't want the fish. There you go. Decked out. That's awesome armor. I gotta make another set of chests. This one over here. We'll use this one just for brick. Just all of our basic building material. Gotta keep this stuff somewhat separate. Oop. 
Sorry for the misclicking. My mouse is acting up. I've had this mouse for three years. I think it's time for a new one. And I guess while we wait, because I really don't want to go back out. I still need more food. I know I have six fish, but it's really not enough. There he goes. So I think I'm gonna. I'm gonna eat a soup. Heal back up. And I'm gonna just gonna catch some fish out here real quick for the night. And I'll show you guys. upon us, even though it's still raining. We didn't get much. A couple more fish, rotten flesh, another bowl. Lots of stuff I really don't need. I did make an iron pick though. We are going to need that when we go back down because we're going to need that to get the gold. We're going to need that to get the redstone. Mm. I love Earl Grey tea. So good. I'm going to cook the rest of this fish up real quick and then we'll head down. I really think they should make fish sustain you a little bit better than just two food. Especially the salmon. Salmon's pretty hearty food as it is. Maybe I can pull you over. Yeah, come here. No? Yeah, you didn't like that, did you? That was way big. Alright. Looks somewhat safe. I heard a witch all night. Oh, my potatoes came up. Just replant it over here. That down. Take this one with us. And head back down. I have to grab one more thing. We're gonna need some wood. So we're gonna need to make some wood stone torches. That's basically gonna be my source of light. Until we get to the nether and get the nether rock. But so far, I hope you guys are enjoying this. I know I am. It's nice. I haven't played hardcore in a while. It keeps you on your feet. Is it this one? Is it the next one? Which one is it? I, I'm lost now. I don't remember which one it is. No, I think it is this one. Yep, here we go. Come on. I swear, I think they put shields in here just because of these little assholes. I remember when we didn't have shields. Man, they were a pain. Let's get this gold. I still think the skeletons are a little bit too beefy still for the game. They're a pain to kill. Alright, hit level 10. Even though it may or may not matter. So let's give us about five torches. One one bad Well there goes my sticks. Uh, one bad side of only using redstone versus regular torches is when you use regular torches you can at least get four off every one whereas with these you can only get one 
But since I'm definitely probably going to find an ample supply of redstone, I might actually make a redstone house. Might put a nice security system in there, keep the creepers and skeletons away from my house. Go drag one of the villagers over for bait. I think that's still allowed. Oh yeah, plenty of redstone. Hey, look at that. Diamond. It's the one and only time I'm not excited to see it because I can't use it. Whew. Whew. I think my heart stopped there for a minute. A little too close for comfort. More of this gold. We're gonna need some gold and apples later. No, I don't want to get that right now. There's plenty of other stuff to get. So I thought about another rule to add: is to only to basically set it up where I have to eat golden apples to regain my hearts. It's a total pain, but. You know what? Hardcore is a pain anyway. So maybe in the future, if I survive long enough, I, I might add it. It might be kind of fun. This, even though I don't really need it right now. Might as well get it. Actually, kind of quiet in here. Not many enemies, which is good for me. Some more redstone. Where's that diamond? I might as well get it because I'm going to need it for the enchanting table. Assuming uh, it could stay there. Assuming I can find obsidian. Still trying to figure that one out. Not 100% sure how I'm going to obtain obsidian yet. So I think what we're going to do, we're going to finish this episode off in a little bit. I'm going to build this nether portal. And clear this out a little bit more. We're just going to do a 2x3. This is just the easiest. Yeah, we'll do a two by three. Make this somewhat safer to walk. We are in hardcore and accidents happen. Grab that water. That is the reason why I did not cap that. I knew I was going to need it. And I think I'm going to start emptying over here. So we're, we're going to build the basic. Yeah, I don't even have to build it. Oh, look. More redstone. Might as well grab this real quick. Ooh, it's a nice pocket. Yeah. All right. All right. So we're basically just gonna dump it. Grab another one. Dump it. Grab our water. That's it. It's really fast. I should have brought dirt for this. Huh, 
Spoke too soon. And he still found a way. It's okay, we'll just kill him real quick. And speaking of dirt, I'll grab this real quick. It's easier to build with dirt when you're building wooden, well, not wooden frames, but when you're building obsidian frames. One of these videos, I'm gonna have to show you guys my obsidian palace I built in survival mode. It's, uh, I think 160 by 160 obsidian palace. It's ridiculous. It took me. It, it had to have been 800 hours of work at least. It was months, months, and months of work to make it, and it's still not 100% finished, but it, it's getting there. But I still need to load all my other files up. Got a new computer. Still haven't put him on. I really don't like these shields. Um. Okay, that happened. Safe from enemies. Last one. And we can start working on the top part. I still need to go find a piece of flint, which I guess I can get right over there. No, no we can keep those. We need those. I hear the zombies coming. A little bit more dirt. No. Definitely thought that was gravel. Definitely andesite. We'll find some gravel. Shouldn't be a big problem. I'm more worried about getting snuck up on. done. One more. Go find gravel. Get some flint. Like flint and steel. We are golden. Let's see when I made this correctly. Looks like I did. Ow. Where are we gonna find some gravel? Hmm. Oh. Oh, do you guys see what I see? I 
see wood. Which means there's a dungeon here. Oh, what luck. Parked our house right next to a dungeon. Oh, we couldn't ask for anything better. So we're gonna head up to the surface real quick because I need more torches anyway. And I'm pretty sure there's some gravel somewhere up at the surface. I think I saw some next to the water. And it's nighttime again. Let's bulk up on food. Mad dash. Still got hit. But it's only one. It's okay. Gives us 12 more. Hold us off for a bit. Wrong bin. Throw that in there. I'll eventually figure out where everything's going. I need to label these. Don't need those. Don't need those. Ow. So I know I could go out and find gravel. But there's a lot of skeletons around. Don't really feel like dying on episode two. So we're gonna play it semi-safe and I'm just gonna chill in here and fish till morning. And I will see you guys in a few minutes. All right guys, and we're back and it's morning. I went ahead and made us a clock. I don't actually know what time it is while we're down. Got a couple of fish, got a clown fish. That'd be good for when we start making potions. And see what's around. I see a creeper, skeleton. Looks like we should be okay. Beats are going good. Thank you for your donation of string. Get these beats up real quick. Don't you blow up my farm? Oh no, no, no. Gunpowder. Man, they are just all over this house like hotcakes. Ooh. Ooh. I just missed that. Where did the stuff? Yep, yep, that, that's what happens when you step out of the water. You, you burn. Alright, let's go find this some gravel real quick. I, want, I really want to light this before we end the episode. I'm hoping there might be some around here. It's not. It's just not looking like it. Nope. Gravel. Come on, just need one. There we go. Let's head to the mine. We'll build this on site. Up, oh, up, oh, nope, nope, nope. Don't want the egg. Just gonna throw it away. There we go. We got our flint and steel. Which means we can light our nether portal. Then 
moment of truth. Did I build it correctly? And I did. All right. So we got us another portal. And next episode, we're going to go venture through. So until next time, see you guys later.